Tangu jadi, kuruka kamba ni mchezo ambao watu wengi wamekuwa kifanya. Na wengi wamekuwa kipitisha tu wakati. Siku hizi sio mchezo wa kitoto tena. Steven Odhiambo alikuwa anacheza mpira hapo awali lakini akaamua kubadili mchezo. Kabla sijaanza kufanya mchezo nilikuwa nilikuwa acheza mpira lakini baada ya kuona mpira nikamchezo wa kumia nikaacha ndo dadangu akani 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 akaniambia kuna mchezo mchezo mwingine ya kuja kuruka sikuwa kwanza kuja nikaruka vizuri lakini watu watu waliniambia ni mchezo wa wasichana sasa ikabidi niwache baada baada ya kwenda darasa la tatu ndo nika nikaamua tu kuingia kwa hiyo mchezo it keeps me fit and i also learn new gymnastics and get flexible mchezo huu Umeweza kuwanufaisha sana watoto hawa kutoka Kibera. Kando na kupata wadhamini wa kuwalipia kare ya shule, wengi wao wameweza kuwakilisha Kenya katika mashindano ya kuruka kamba ulimwenguni. Mimi naitwa Michelle, nasoma Makini School, niko class 8. Uh, tangu nianze jump rope, nimesaidia nikapata scholarship. Kenda Makini School tangu class 3. Eh uh, pia kenda US. Last year, tena this year nimeenda Norway. Kocha wao David ananieleza lengo lake la kuanzisha mchezo huu hapa nchini. To me, uh, why I've decided to play jump rope is because um, football is crowded. Everybody wants to play um, soccer. Everybody wants to run like the marathoners. Um, Everybody wants to play um, the known sport but jump rope is not known that's why I, I like doing jump rope and uh, jump rope is unique the only sport that will bring a girl and a boy in the same stage and they will compete so that's why I'm doing jump rope so I like that inclusivity Mchezo huu una mvutio wa kipekee maintaining again it comes again with the interest of the kids because uh once uh, the child start uh, jumping and he or she gains that interest um the next day he will come and after attending the competition and seeing how jump rope has that um competition stiffness he will or he or she will want to try more and more at least to be in an international uh, standard Kikosi hiki kinajiandaa kwa mashindano ya ulimwengu yatakayofanyika nchini Canada mwaka ujao. We had our championship in Norway in July. So uh, we are just working for the next year's tournament that will be happening in Ottawa, Canada. And uh, yeah, the current uh, team that we are working with, they are good. I know um, we'll be able to win more medals and put our, our flag high. Wakiwa wanajiandaa kunazo changamoto wanazozipitia Getting the ropes we don't have that access of getting the ropes uh, because uh, we don't have the companies or any sports house that uh, sell the rope within uh, Kenya so uh, we have to depend on the donations when we go for our tournaments that is how we get the ropes and um, again the other thing um, getting the funds to enable us attend the tournaments that is the major challenge because we are not getting any help from the government wakijiandaa kwa mashindano ya Afrika ya urukaji kamba kocha anasema wana matumaini ya kufanya vyema we expect uh, to put our map high so uh, we want uh, everybody to know that uh, there is a team in Kenya doing jump rope and it's not only the sport for the western countries we want uh, kenyan to be known apart from uh, marathons be uh, playing rugby we want jump rope to be uh, among the top um, sports in the country okay.
kwa kweli mchezo huu una manufaa tele kwa watoto mbali na kukuza talanta masomo pia yanatiliwa manani Just as mtuani kiripotia TV 47 Nairobi